Uh, my name is Tom Durkin. Uh, I'm a student here at the Academy of Art University. Uh, I also work at the Children's Creativity Museum. So this is my project. It's called Marble Paint. Um, it basically has two components. One is a traditional sort of maze labyrinth uh, game that's like a, a sort of wooden ball uh, maze that's been around for a long time. Um, I took that and then added a color tracking camera attached to one Arduino Omega, and then that sends that information to a program I wrote in processing that takes the location of a marble of different colors placed onto this table uh, and then uses that to make a visualization on my computer. So essentially my project tra tracks two different colors of balls, a green one and a blue one. The green one, when you place it on there, will create a sort of rainbow trail. And then I can use my iPad to control the two servos that will control the two axes of movement. And so on my screen over there, you can see that it's tracking the location of the ball and then translating that to a visualization that I wrote in processing. I can use the spacebar to clear the screen. And then when I put a different color marble, the blue one, it'll create a rainbow particle field. And so it'll take, in a very similar way, it'll take the location of that blue marble and it'll create a particle field around that location of that marble and sort of move it around and you can use it to paint the screen. To get two of the pieces to talk at once, I'm using one Arduino to control the servos uh, and then another Arduino to uh, sort of get the data from the camera. And I was able to do one and the other separately, but getting them to do both at the same time was one of my first challenges. Um, so I had to have them communicate on different channels over the serial port in order to, for the, uh, the data that they were sending not to compete with each other. Um, the Johnny5 uh, JavaScript library allows me to not only control these projects from the web, but to use something like my iPad to send uh, accelerometer data or button presses uh, to control my project over here. The inspiration for my project really came from the hardware. Um, I found this camera called a Pixie camera, um, and what it does is it tracks different objects based on their color. So I can say, here's a blue marble, track its location. Uh, here's a green marble, track its location. And so I was really interested in what sort of things that I could do with that.